in a DeLorean car. Just don't ask me to accept this. Okay? That's his dog, Einstein. He's told to meet at a you know, quarter past one in the morning at Twin Pines Mall to test out the car to see if it works. What does it run on? It runs on plutonium. Where did he get the plutonium? From Libyan terrorists. <laughs> he was supposed to make a bomb for the Libyan terrorists. They gave them plutonium and instead he made a time machine. Any good, good scientist would do. But the Libyan terrorists found out that he didn't do what they asked. They tracked him down into this parking lot and they killed him. Marty is freaked out, but he has this car. So he says, why don't I take the car, go back in time, warn the doctor, and that way he won't get killed. Thus the movie unfolds, okay? Now, so what happens? He goes back in time 30 years. This movie was made in 1985 and takes place in 1985. He goes back 30 years to 1955. 1955. Thank you for doing the math. So, in 1955, what was this probably? It was probably not a, a mall. What was it? A field. A farm, okay? A farm. So, he, he actually goes back in time. He wants to go back a little bit of time, but he has to accidentally goes back 30 years, right? So that's a problem. But fine, he gets around that. So, he goes back 30 years, and lands on Twin Pines Ranch. It's a ranch, okay? And those are the Twin Pines, <laughs> carefully cordoned off by the owner. He clearly cares about them. We are 30 years in the past. Uh, Marty lands on his farm in a DeLorean. <laughs> Since this is America, <laughs> <laughs> if you're a farmer in America and a DeLorean lands in your field, what's the first thing you're going to do? Shoot it, okay. So the farmer comes after him, shoot it, and Marty has to escape quickly. And so as he escapes, he knocks over one of the pine trees. And then he comes out, and it's like he escapes as fast as he can from Twin Pines Ranch. But there's only one pine tree there now, because he killed it. Now, I will forgive the movie for within 20 seconds going from dark to light, okay? I'm okay with that. He manages to get back to the future, and he's running. He just has to get to the, to the, he manages to warn the doctor. And he goes back to the mall, okay? And he sees this playing out in front of him. And we get back to the mall 30 years later. <laughs> Lone Pine Mall! That's good! That's, that's good! And the camera didn't like zoom in on it, or you just had to catch that. Wow. What I call those um, Easter eggs. If you're Christian, but if you're Jewish, what? <laughs> a Christian reference. Easter. Well, actually, Easter eggs themselves are not particularly Christian. <laughs> like dyed chicken embryos. <laughs> Jesus. I just don't remember that in the Bible. That's all. I read the Bible. Steal the embryos from chickens, boil them, draw on them with crayons, put them in dye with vinegar, and then hide them from children. That's Leviticus. <laughs> Topic? Time travel. 